now let us discuss about relational operators in javascript relational operators can also be called as comparison operators also comparison operators also in c c++ java we have six relational operators such as greater than greater than or equal to less than less than or equal to double is equal to and not is equal to whereas in javascript we have two more relational operators such as triple is equal to which is known as strict equality operator strict equality operator uh, and we have one more operator called uh, uh, not double is equal to which is called as strict inequality operator strict inequality operator so first let us discuss about greater than greater than or equal to less than less than or equal to and then we will see about equals to not equals to strict equal uh, strict equality operator and strict uh, inequality operator uh, the result of a relational operator is always uh, a boolean value the result of relational operator is always a boolean value boolean means logical value it may be either true or false okay true or false uh, let us see relational operators are mainly useful for uh, comparing two operands so in order to compare two operands we use as relational operators what is operand operand may be either a variable or value a constant okay uh, let us see about uh, relational operators one by one uh, let us declare two variables where a is equal to 10 comma b is equal to 20 so let us see the first operator document dot write document dot write off uh, place the content within the header tag so that uh, the content will be displayed in uh, bold style so plus a greater than b so this is the first relational operator greater than operator so a greater than b what is a value 10 what is b value 20 10 greater than 20 condition is false so we will get false as the output let us see the output here we are getting false as the output now let us see the next operator next operator that is uh, uh, greater than less than operator less than operator control c here uh, we use as relational operators not only for comparing two numbers we can also compare two strings or number with string or string with number or number with boolean value also now let us compare two strings here uh, let the first string is where c is equal to let the first string is ram comma d is equal to ram d is equal to ram c is less than d c less than d here what is the first string ram second string is ram it compares the two strings character by character here the ascii value of small a ascii means american standard code for information interchange every character in the keyboard has some ascii value the ascii value of small a is 97 the ascii value of small z is 122 whereas the ascii value of capital a is 65 for capital z it is 90 uh, it compares the first character of both the strings r with r they are same so it compares the second character of both the strings a a they are same so it compares the third character m m they are same so it compares the next character here we don't have any character in c so whereas here we have the ascii value as u so we can say that this ascii value is less than this ascii value so the condition is true so it produces true as the output so false true so this is about greater than and uh, uh, less than now let us see about uh, greater than or equal to greater than or equal to let the first number is 10 uh, whereas the second number is also 10 10 greater than or equal to 10 greater than or equal to means greater than or equals to so 10 is equals to 10 so it produces true as the output so let us observe the output here it produces true as the output now let us see the next operator that is less than or equal to less than or equal to a less than or equal to p here what is a 10 
what is b 20 10 is less than or equal to 20 so less than or equal to means less than or equals to 10 less than 20 so condition is true so it produces true as the output let us observe the output here so it produces true as the output so this is about greater than greater than or equal to less than and less than or equal to so the result of relational operator is always a boolean value now let us see about equality operators and strict equality operators so document dot write ln of uh, let the first number is 10 second number is 20 so 10 double equal to 20 10 double equal to 20 so equality operator so 10 and 20 are not equal so it, it produces false as the output 10 double equal to 20 it produces false as the output why because they are not equal let us see the next example uh, let the first number is uh, let the first number is uh, 10 second number is within the double quotations 10 so it means it is a string here the problem with equality operator is it compares two operands whether those two operands are of same type or different type if those operands are equal then it returns true here 10 the first two 10 is a number whereas the second 10 is a string but 10 10 those are equal but the, those two are belonging to the different data type but here the problem is it returns true as the output even though they are of different type let us see the output here so it is producing true as the output okay now let us see one more example uh, let the first operand is 0 uh, whereas the second operand is uh, false 0 and false here false means 0 only whereas 1 means true only but 0 means it is a number whereas false means it is boolean data type but what is the problem with equality operator it returns true even though the operands may be of different data type so it returns true as the output why because 0 and false are same so it returns true as the output so this is about equality operator in order to overcome the problem with equality operator we have to use strict equality operator this triple is equal to is called as strict equality operator triple is equal to means strict equality strict the name itself specifies the meaning so it returns true whether those two operands are of same type whether those two operands are of different type it returns simply the false value so let us work with same examples document dot write ln of let us see the same examples so 10 triple is equal to 20 so 10 and 20 they are false so it produces it produces false as the output if you observe here here we got false as the output now let us see about the next two two so these two are very very important so control c control v so 10 triple is equal to strict equality operator 0 double equal to false here 10 and 10 these two are of different data type so it returns false as the output 0 triple equal to false these two are of different data type so it returns false as the output so here what are the remaining two lines false false if you observe here false false so in javascript it is better to use strict equality operator triple is equal to operator in place of double is equal to operator what is the problem with double is equal to operator it returns true whether the values are equal and those values may be of different data type also whereas strict equality means it returns true only when the operands are of same data type as well as the values are equal okay now let us see about not equal to operator so not equal to means uh, we know we know in c and c plus plus it is just like that only so 10 not equal to 10 true next 0 not equal to false 0 is uh, uh, 0 not equal to false okay so it also returns what let us see the output false as the output so 10 not equal to 10 yes but one is what number another one is what A string so 10 and 10 are equal but here the condition is not equal to so false as the output 0 not equal to false but 0 and false are equal so 0 and not equal to false means 
it also returns false as the output okay just like uh, c c plus plus and java only now let us see about uh, the last operator that is uh, strict inequality operator with the same examples as uh, strict equality operator strict inequality operator so let us uh, save this program once and let us observe the outputs uh, here we have some errors uh, so so document dot write off h1 plus 10 double equal to 20 uh, 10 double 10 triple equal to 10 yeah no errors control s uh, script tag yeah some error is there now let us identify that error so document dot uh, here uh, uh, there is no need of the statement let us eliminate the statement so the strict equality operator h1 plus 10 double equal to 20 uh, we have closed the h1 tag uh, next uh, h1 10 double equal to 10 let us uh, see the output yeah if you observe here if you observe here we got false 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 as the output 10 double equal to 20 means false 10 and 10 th th those are of different uh, data type so it is producing false as the output 0 and false means false here uh, uh, let us see the next one that is uh, strict inequality operator strict inequality operator it is denoted by not double is equal to not double is equal to it is completely opposite to the strict equality operator if it is uh, if strict equality operator returns true then it returns strict inequality operator returns false so it returns uh, uh, true when uh, those two are different when the two operands are different and those two operands are of different data type otherwise it returns false okay so strict uh, this is what inequality operator inequality operator um, let us uh, run the program let us run the program it simply reverses the output so you will get output as true 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 if you observe here strict inequality means it is entirely opposite to the strict equality operator okay so this is about uh, relational or uh, comparison operators in javascript